Hey guys, what's going on? Back up here once again with another video. This time I'm going to give you my thoughts on the Andre the Giant HBO documentary. Just watched it for the second time. Absolutely incredible stuff right here. It's up there with me, in my opinion, with the 30 for 30 special on Ric Flair that ESPN did. This was just as good, if not better, because, you know... I knew about Andre, but I didn't really know that much about him. And this documentary really gave me great insight into the man, Andre the Giant, a legend, a pioneer in this industry. Andre Rene Rusimov, his actual name, born in 1946 in France. At a young age, how he, you know, had to deal with giantism how that affected him throughout his life I was able to use that to transcend into the professional wrestling industry and become one of the you know greatest stars and literally the biggest one of the biggest stars if not the biggest star of all time just in terms of his height his size I mean he when I went to Wrestlemania 29 it's getting a little bit off subject here but it relates to Andre. They have the life-size statue of Andre the Giant. And to stand next to that, just to see what he would have been like, it's incredible. And if you're a fan of wrestling, I recommend you go out of your way to watch this. Uh, this was very well done, put together by ES, uh, uh, HBO, I should say. Produced in part with WWE. They had interviews with guys like um, Tim White. It was very close friends with Andre. I drove him, you know, as his handler in WWE. He was spoke very highly and did a great job in this documentary. They interviewed Vince, gave a lot of insight into his relationship with Andre. Interviewed with Hogan, of course it's Hogan, so you don't got to watch what he's saying there. Is he actually telling you the truth or not? But I think he was being very genuine in here. I have to say. Talking about, of course, the, the legendary match between Hogan and Andre at WrestleMania 3. So get goosebumps watching that. Ric Flair's in here. Um, Dave Meltzer was in here. Uh, you had um, just a great, you know, story that was told about Andre's life throughout this um, documentary. Arnold Schwarzenegger. Billy Crystal, Rob Reiner, Andre's family, which is great getting insight into the, you know, the people that Andre lived with, his brothers, you know, just getting that insight of, you know, knowing the man himself. Um, it's all the good and the bad, you know, Andre had a lot of health problems, you know, with gigant gigantism, and the, you know, the bigger he got, the more pain he was in, and you know, when he drank, and he was a legendary heavy, you know, famous for drinking a lot. And, and this documentary certainly gave great insight into that. Um, I think he said he drank 20 bottles of wine. It's just incredible. But he drank also because of the pain. I mean, he was in, the older he got, the more weight, you know, it's just his body it just started to break down. And he didn't want to go to the doctors. He he said, no, I'm okay, this is the way that God made me, and this is how I'm going to live my life. But, I mean, you could tell. It, it was great seeing footage for me of Andre, you know, in his prime. When Man, he, he was incredible. We all remember, of course, you know, his later years in WWF, but when he would travel from territory to territory, you know, as the attraction, as the giant, he, he was incredible. I could only imagine what it would have been like to watch Andre the Giant wrestle. So, this was an hour and a half. It flew by like that. They also interviewed Andre's daughter. And, um, interesting insight there. But, um, to me it really touched on every aspect of Andre's life. You know, his upbringing getting into wrestling, traveling throughout the territories, the struggles, you know, having a family, being on the road, his body breaking down, WrestleMania 3, the match with Hogan, 
Um, then his later years in life where his health really took a turn for the worst. Um, my words here can't do this justice. This was a really great documentary. One of the better ones I've seen in a while, especially on professional wrestling. I think they did uh, Andre Justice. So those are my thoughts here on the Andre the Giant documentary on HBO. Catch it on a re-airing, find a way to watch it on demand. Whatever way you can watch it, uh, you should because it does a really outstanding job here um, portraying the, the life and times of the legend simply known as Andre the Giant. So that does it here for my um, review for the Andre the Giant HBO documentary. Be sure to click my like and subscribe button here on youtube.com slash danielguys412 for all my latest thoughts. Be sure to follow me on Twitter at danielguys412. And be sure to check out my Facebook page, facebook.com slash danielguys1994. So that does it for me, guys. I am out. Until then, I will catch you guys in my next video, whenever that may be. So until then, guys, thanks for watching.